Hello everyone, my name is Sabrina Melodius. Welcome to my channel. Today's video is Vlogmas Day 3 and 4. Yes, 3 and 4, two days in one. And I sure hope I'm looking where I'm supposed to look. I really don't know. So, uh, yesterday I could not do a Vlogmas Day video. I am so sorry. It was my son's birthday yesterday, sweet 16. Yes, sweet 16. And um, I cannot believe just how uh, the years are rolling by, rolling and rolling. And it seems that the, the older you get, the, the faster the years are going. I used to hear that a lot <laughs> from the older people. But I guess now I am an older person and I find myself saying the same thing. <laughs> the days are getting shorter and the months are getting shorter. The years are rolling by, wondering what's happening and um, finding myself waking up at four o'clock in the morning, wondering why that is. And now it's early. My son's just gone to school early. But I am starting to look a little bit tired and I wonder if it's because it looks like a dark day outside. And in fact, with the brightest light and the curtains open, it still looks relatively uh, like a dark day. Looking out the window, I see a lot of clou uh, snow clouds are still about. There's still a bit of snow on the ground, not that much. But there's still some and it's snowing a little bit now, but we will see. I'm not grumbling. I do like the snow. I don't like to walk on frozen snow, but I like to look at it. At least it's beautiful, isn't it? We don't get it here very often. Uh, mostly we don't these, day, uh, these years as the ro years are rolling by. We are getting less and less snow. I think it's quite worrying for nature. But anyhow, this is not what we're here for. This is Vlogmas days three and four. How did you all have a week, uh, weekend this weekend? Okay, that question did not go well. Let's start fresh with this question. Did you all have a good weekend? Think that went better uh, and like I said it was my son's birthday yesterday so we had the little celebration he got uh, a tons of new Yu-Gi-Oh cards I'll show you one of the packs he got three packs and one of them is this one Yu-Gi-Oh GX yes I have to admit that my favorite uh, card, I have two, maybe maybe three, maybe four, but I'm only going to mention the two. Uh, one is um, the Dark Magician. Oh, he's so dreamy. And I like the Dark Magician girl. Oh, she's just too cute. Yes, and then there's a little Kuribo. And there's another little pink one, I forgot the name. If my son was here today, he would just tell me. And uh, yeah, I just love the little Yu-Gi-Oh characters and uh, the anime, manga, everything. Anything to do with Yu-Gi-Oh, I am a huge fan. And with my son, we both love, uh, love Yu-Gi-Oh. So it is something that we enjoy doing both of us together. So anyhow, so we spent uh, a long time yesterday watching films and uh, what did we watch? We watched uh, Scott Pilgrim and one of the Yu-Gi-Oh films, which was the, on the dark, no, on the side of the, no, the dark dimension side, I think that's the one, Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, Yes, and what else did we do? We did other things. We had a special meal, of course, birthday cake. So we had a lovely day together, just the two of us. It was wonderful. And uh, yes, yeah, so I am uh, ready to do 
days three and four. I am trying to pause, it's not working. <laughs> and I am back. I had to pause because I wanted to show you again the item I want to make out of the um, mini balls of yarn from this advent calendar. And this is the cardigan that I am aiming to make. Uh, there will be a huge difference with this one because mine will be worked in stripes, different colors. I've got 12 colors. I don't know what yet. I only know of two colors. And they will be worked in stripes. The, uh, there will be other colors here. This is just worked in one colorway. Uh, this is not showing too well just now. There we are. This is really nice. So I got this pattern and I, I started, I did the ribbing for the back section because I wanted to know if I would have enough yarn really for the ribbing section or how much more would I need. So I did the ribbing for the back section, which is here. It's done. It's all done. It did say 24 rows and I can't remember how many stitches, 140 something. Um, it's worked on 2.75 millimeter needles. So that's why quite a lot of stitches. So I've done that. And out of that mini ball, ball of yarn, I, I really I don't have a lot, um, maybe less than one row. I will show you. This is all I have left out of the one ball. That's it. So now I, I gauged with it and uh, I know there's another ball of yarn in this color in there somewhere. So I'm go going to wait, but I've ordered another three thinking that should do. With the one in there, I can do Two front panel, the two panels, the two front panels for the ribbing. So that I'm covered. So I'm thinking one ball will do for the sleeves, and then two for the neck area, and then the button there. I'm hoping that will be enough, otherwise, I'll have to order some more. So today I'm expecting a package with the three balls of yarn and honestly I think the postage costs more than the yarn itself <laughs> but hey at least I, I think I will have enough to do this ribbing section and then I can get a start so now I'm thinking uh, to save more yarn because we're very limited with the yarn availability this much per ball um, is that I will start the other two front panel and then when I come to working on the body of it I am going to work all sides together because then I'll have no sewing as well here on the side but ultimately I won't waste any yarn here when you break the colors so um, that's what I'm planning to do and hoping that I will have enough. Otherwise, I'll just have to order some more colors. Uh, so this is where I might need my son's help to, um, to see what we can do. But anyway, I will figure this out and I will keep showing you my work in progress. So today, I've got my um, calendar. And we are going to open days three and four. Three and four. Are you ready? Okay, days three and four. So that is my son's birthday. Third of December, yes. There we are. Oh, I like what I see. 
So now we know my favorite color is red and then pink, but I always, always make other items with bright yellow. Why? Because I love the sunshine and any color that reminds me of the sunshine is good because the sunshine here, it comes rarely. And when it does, it comes for maybe just a few minutes at a time, then off it goes. So when I see the sunshine in colors here, it makes me so happy. So this color, it, we don't really know what it's called. It's, it's shade number 208. And here it is, look at it. Okay, now it should be a bit more, this is a bit lighter than what it really is. But it is pretty close to the, the color. Isn't that beautiful? That reminds me of the sunshine. Okay, so far I'm quite impressed with the colors that my son chose. There was this one. Then there was a, a very pale lemon. Now this. What's coming next? It's bound to be something I don't like this time around, yes? I'm dreading it. Okay, day number four. We've opened days one, two, three. I wish there was a way that we could leave those open, but we can't. So, day number four, yes? Day number four. Okay. Oh, okay. That looks interesting. Yes, that's day number four, which is today, Monday the 4th. And it is a bright orange, bright orange. Shade number 189. Really like a bright orange. Look at this. Again, this is a tiny bit lighter on the camera than what it should be, but it's still pretty amazing uh, orange, which is a nice color again. And I wasn't expecting my son to choose that. At some point in uh, his younger days, he's still very young, but when he was a bit younger, his favorite color was orange. So I wonder if that's why he chose that one. It isn't now. Now, I'm not sure it might be black or red. I like both, I really enjoy both, especially together. But um, yeah, so day three and day four. Okay, now I'm excited to get a start on the body of, the, of this card again. But I can't yet because I'm waiting for this section. Uh, no, the next section, but I'm waiting for the color to arrive so that I can start on the front panels. And then I can put them all together and work a gigantic row. That should work, yes? So I am excited to get started with this. In the meantime, I'll just have to work on something else. Um, I might show you tomorrow what I'm working on today. So stay tuned for that. Right, so I think today is um, the fourth, isn't it? At least I hope it is. Yes, of course it is. Monday the 4th. <laughs> I know that today we are going to look at his cards in a, a lot more details. So I'm really looking forward to it when he comes home from school, of course. Uh, so yeah, I think I'll leave it at that for today. And I'll be back tomorrow for day number five. Okay, so I will see you all tomorrow and until then happy knitting and crochet everyone